hello friends welcome back to my youtube channel in this video i am showing a small room how to create a small room and ceiling and how to fix that light in the ceiling please watch my video if you like my video please subscribe my channel so for example i am just going to lighting and i am just taking going to the architectural and i am creating a small wall over here like uh, around uh, uh, it's having around uh, six six thousand and then around six thousand down from here to here i am just connecting so the wall is created then i need to fix uh, some doors also so for example i am placing one door over here if you look in the 3D, you can see here. I uh, will just expanding this, stretching this one from here. Uh, the building structure was created. Then, uh, what we need to do? We just need to uh, do one floor also. Just go here, floor. And this is a simple floor. I'm just uh, giving offset around uh, 250. Just um, selecting like this. So this is a simple floors. Okay, just you can see here the floor is created, and uh, we just need to give you some ceiling also. For the ceiling, I am just selecting from here a sketch ceiling, and here I am just giving around uh, two seven five zero for ceiling height. Selecting from here, and I am just taking like this a simple uh, ceiling if you look in the ceiling so you can see here the ceiling grids and everything and i'm just going to vv and i'm giving um, which of the elevations from there and then we need to how to fix the symbol uh, lighting over through this uh, ceiling so go to system and uh, go to the lighting and we'll have a lot of uh, lighting fixes uh, families over here so i'm choosing this one and there will be option like a uh, vertical and uh, place on face if you place in the vertical so if the light will come on the vertical wall and i am using the place on face and i am facing uh, placing one light over in the center of the ceiling and i need to check whether it was in the ceiling so just go to the 3d view so you can see it was fixed in the ceiling right then then we need to arrange the, uh, as per the ceiling grids so these lights so before that we can change the color of the lights and everything so if you can go to the vv then you can uh, go to the lighting fixers so you can do it from here also so i'm changing this lighting around to blue for okay just to click okay so the light you can see here the light fixer showing over here and oh, once you've done that one just you can copy this one copy one light so after one two three grids one light and one two three you can <clears throat> put another light so you can adjust like this as per the ceiling grids you can adjust it and just copy this one copy from here and you can place another lights over here and another lights over here so like that you can arrange it the lights okay so then uh, we just need to move one more grid over here for example so i'm just moving from here one more grid left okay then the light all lights are fixed here right then what we need to do see can you can see all the lights is fixed in the ceilings properly so then we have some if if you, if you have some other um, like uh, other things for example some uh, um, some other uh, fire alarm device if you need so you can go to here you can take it from here the fire alarm if you want to put the fire alarm over here so you can place over the one fire alarm over here and another one if you want to place one here one here so that is also fixed over here if you look in the 3d if you can select that one so you can see the fire alarm also fixed over there so like that we can make the ceiling coordinations so you go to here and you can see clearly the fire alarm also fixed 
so you can do the lot of uh, things from here like uh, if you want uh, some other communication devices in the ceiling it uh, whatever it's coming so you can place that one and then um, some um, mechanical equipment also you can get it from here some kind of uh, diffuser or something like that if you if you need so you can uh, uh, you can place the, the that diffusers and everything over here as per the si size of uh, size of the ceiling you can place that ceilings and everything and uh, ev even these sprinklers also you can place it so I'm, I'm just placing one one more sprinklers also so just go here and you can place from here okay so just uh, sprinkler so I'm fixing one sprinkler over here and another one the sprinkler is here so if you go to the ceiling <coughs> we need to check whether it was coming uh, in the proper height so we just go to view so you can see the sprinklers are in the placed in the uh, floor so just need to move this one up to the Otherwise, you can go to the edit work plane, pick a plane, and pick the ceiling. So the sprinkler will be come up on the ceiling. So you can see here the sprinklers are here. So you can see the sprinklers are uh, already placed over here. So as per the in the ceiling layout, you can uh, make it that one. So I'm just VV, and you can check it that the sprinkler is open over here. So it was not showing over here. That is what. So type VV and uh, check check in that one. So you can see the sprinklers. So then you can adjust uh, sprinklers as per your as per exactly in the in the ceiling grid. Then you can copy this one. Once you set up the C uh, sprinkler, so then you can uh, copy it also. So you can if you want to change that one, you can change the color for the sprinklers and everything. This is the way we just need to arrange in the uh, in the ceiling. This one, if even even you can place the sockets and everything in the wall also. So if you go to lighting or power, then you just need to place your electrical fixes also. So if you need some kind of sockets, so you can, you can uh, pl uh, place the sockets also in the in the wall. For example, I'm just placing the sockets like this. For example, if you require the so how many of sockets you require, so you can place the sockets also. So if you go to the 3D view, you can see the uh, sockets was placed over there, but it was not in the proper height. So just select this all the sockets. Uh, only go to the filter option, electrical fixes, select that one, and you can just say like this one is 450 from the uh, uh, from the floor. So you can see the uh, sockets was fixed over there. Different kind of sockets you can place if, if you need uh, something like a different type of sockets. Okay, you can um, give that one also. And and we can place some electrical equipment also. Uh, electrical equipment like uh, the C uh, SMDBs, DBs, and everything. So for example, I'm just placing a DB. Uh, so just a vertical face. And you can place the DBs over here. For example, this DB you can need to give the panel name over here, like uh, uh, DB DB power or power or lighting DBP LP. We can just say like a LP. And then if you need to do the wiring, okay, so you can do the wiring also here. Just select this one. And uh, for example, I just need to give a wiring for this tree, give a power and select uh, the DB panel from here and just give the wiring. So easily you can do it the wiring also. For example, this three sockets I need to connect this one. Just give a wire. So that will be come up over here. If you want to change the wire um, color, so just go to wire, select from here and red and click OK and uh, here you can give the patterns for that one click ok and if you want to change the line weight of this one just give a 4 or something like that <coughs> here you can see the line weights and you clearly you can see that this was connected to the uh, DB and if you can if you need to give the tag for this one okay you can give the tag for the uh, DBs 
and even the <coughs> lights and everything uh, you can adjust the wiring uh, like this that that is depends upon you the presentation wise you can adjust it and uh, even even you can give all the uh, different different type of this one so for example i'm just duplicating this one selecting this one edit type so this is the edit type so you can go to the edit type and you can duplicate this one like a d1 and uh, just need to give a type mark also type mark also i'm just giving d1 okay for selecting this three light three four lights like this and i'm changing this one uh, d1 this here you can see the d1 and this type of lights i am just giving um, and duplicating this one as a d2 so you can give the d2 light click ok and uh, type mark also you can give a d2 just click ok so these lights are coming um, d2 and you just need to ta just tag it that one so it was not showing that uh, the lighting tag select this one edit uh, family and here you can give the label so i am just removing this one and uh, just give a type mark type mark add that one and uh, load into the project overwrite so you can see over here select this one and just uh, just edit type and just uncheck the box visibility and even the leader also you can remove it and you can place the light like this uh, if you need to uh, give a leader so you can give the leader also so you just need to place like that you can uh, place the lighting names and everything no need to uh, give a leader uncheck from here and just place this one and tag it again place this one and before that you can uncheck the leader so you can easily give the tag for the lights like simply you can give the tag for this one tag for this one and this is d2 this is d2 and this is d2 and this is d2 so this is a simple floor and if you want to connect a lighting so with the power so you can give the power for the lights select all the lights can give the power for the lights and uh, you can just uh, give, give the wiring like that so it will it will connecting to the uh, uh, all the lights so th this is the way we just need to do the uh, lighting and power for a simple uh, floors so if you if you need a good do, doing the coordination for the ceiling you can do the coordination also so if you look at the 3d view so it will look like it was it was placing all the things are placing in the floor thanks for watching thank you